down, calm down, you're okay. Here, let me get that bag out of your head. There we are. Oh, look at that gorgeous face. Me? <laughs> Don't be silly. You know who I am. You don't. No, no. That's not right. You. You do know me. Yes, you do. You saved me from killing myself. That day in the parking tower, or whatever you Americans call it, I was at the very top and you saved me. You grabbed me and pulled me back from me jumping off. I... I couldn't understand it. You were so angry, so determined for me to leave. And as you brought me to that mental facility to have me looked after it, hit me. You love me. <laughs> yes, you love me so much. You do anything to keep me alive. Oh, baby, it was so romantic. You even came to visit me in the hospital to make sure I was alright. But you, you never made contact afterward. Don't worry, my precious love. I understand why you didn't. Yes, I, I, I do you were playing hard to get. But you didn't have to, baby, because you already got me. <laughs> <sighs> but it's okay now. I thought it was cute. I watched you to get to do now you. Let me just say, those monsters at your work are disgusting. Hmm? What monsters? The women at your workplace that so just because you aren't the traditional Adonis looking man, they treat you like scum and force you so much work on you. But I see that through you are the most gorgeous man in the world, not for looks, though you are pretty cute, but I mean your heart. You are a man that risks his life for the one he loves. I wanted to get stubby, stubby with those monsters at your work. But I didn't. You know why? It's because it will have taken time away from looking at you, my sweet love. <laughs> you finally noticed. <clears throat> yes, you're under a Christmas tree. You see, I've been watching you for a year and... Uh? Hmm, yonder, you say? <gasps> yes. I guess you could call me that. But then that means you know you will be well taken care of. Oh, it's so sad to see a yonder's love unrequited. But you see, I am smarter than most yonder. I snatch you up before some dumb fake monster comes to defile you. That's right. 
You're safe now. And you see, you're under my tree because what I wanted for Christmas was you. And I've been such a very good girl. But don't worry, I am more naughty than good. And you'll find that out later. <laughs> Not nice. That that was harmful, baby. Please stop. I only wanted to make you happy. Don't say that. Don't. I said stop. No, 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 no. I'm I'm sorry, babe. So sorry. Shh. Sh 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 don't be afraid. I'm I'm not going to hurt you, please, please. Yes, shh, shh, that's right. You're safe. Don't worry. I'm the good kind of yandere. Yes. You see, there are two types of yandere's. They kill you to keep you and to kill others to keep you. I am to kill others to keep you. But no one has had to die. Yet. And if you be good, no one will. But I don't think you'll betray me. After all, you have enough family here. Barely any friends. You just sit in your house and play games. You've barely ever left your house other than to shop for groceries, watch your car, walk or go to a restaurant. Do you remember playing with a girl a lot on your games? I love you forever 79, maybe. Yes, that was me. You were so gallant, how you protected me. We were a perfect team. You even said you loved playing with me. You have no idea how happy that made me. You know, nowadays yanders have it so, so much easier to stalk their loves. We have internet, Facebook, Instagram, of course, online playing video games. Uh, are you trying to struggle out of the ropes? Oh, honey, you want to hug me, don't you? <laughs> oh. Are you trying to get fresh with me? Oh, you cute little beast. <laughs> mm, but no, not yet. I can't unwrap you yet. Not until Christmas. But it is only December 4th. So we have a few weeks. And in those weeks, I'll make you see how much you love me. Oh, don't worry, baby. I won't use any pain. No, 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 no. Shh, shh, shh. Come here, my love. Shh, shh, shh. Let's sit you up. That's right. Mm. Don't worry. When it's time for bed, I'll bring you out a sleeping bag. And sleep next to you. And I'll give you a pillow and a blanket. You know, I always find the living room beautiful and illuminated by the Christmas lights. It's soothing and calming and drifts me into a new sea of tranquility. 
you know? I've actually never had a Christmas. Yes, we always had a tree, but I never got any presents. I was a good girl, though. I did my homework. I worked hard. I never hurt anyone. I never talked back. I was a good obedient child. But my parents never gave me presents. All they did was party and let their friends come near me. But I want to get into that. That's the past. Right now is the present. The wonderful present. I think after so many years of never making trouble, I deserve something nice. And I want you. Yes, all I want is you, my sweet love. My darling, my sweet, sweet darling. You are my everything. My world, my sun, the air I breathe, the moon, the stars. My world is not complete without you. What happened to my parents? I... I ran away. My father tried to have his friends do things to me for money. And I ran. I've been all alone for seven years now. I tried to make friends, but no one wanted to talk to me. Everyone thought I was weird and crazy. <laughs> Finally, I I couldn't take the loneliness, and I just wanted to die. But then, you, oh, my darling, you appeared as if God was sending someone to me in my direst hour of need to tell me I'll never be alone again. Every day I watched, I talked to you with you online, and just being around you brightened my world. I felt happier, more stable. I even got a promotion at my job. My life has been increasingly better since you came into it. <sighs> I love you so much, my darling. Now that you're here, everything is perfect. We can get married, have children. <laughs> uh, little use scurrying around in the house. That's such an adorable thought. <laughs> Sorry, I know you're scared, but, but please, just give me a chance. If you do, I promise you won't regret it. And some of it will be the same. You know us playing games and having fun. <sighs> oh, I am an excellent cook. Like you will always have a watering mouth when you smell my cooking. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I'm baking a pumpkin pie right now. Yes, I know that's usually for Thanksgiving, but it can be done for Christmas too. Well done. Mm -hmm. Alright, here, this 
this. Mm, please, baby, don't make me sad. I promise there's nothing in it. <laughs> there we go. See? Good, right? <sighs> I knew you'd love it. So, after this month, I hope you'll give me a chance. And when Christmas comes... <laughs> that's when I get to have my Christmas present. <sighs> I can't wait to unwrap you, baby. All I want for Christmas and my whole life is you, baby. Now and forever. <laughs> and I promise I'll make you happy for the rest of your life. I love you so much, honey. <laughs>